Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to World of Warships with all the advent calendar videos. I nearly don't get around to do normal stuff anymore. Or at least World of Warships stuff anymore. Not even to talk about my single player stuff that I usually do. But I just play a round of Fuso Battleship match. Let's see if I can still do it. Or if that will be horrible, horrible painful and it will probably be very slow to begin with let's see we got destroyers Ooh, lots of destroyers even two uh, Japanese ones with good range we got a Suiho aircraft carrier a Congo battleship oh we have two battleships and both are tier 6 to Nürnberg and the Furutaka hmm the destroyers look most dangerous. The rest is okay-ish, I guess. So where are the most cruisers? They're on the right side. So I will head over there, here, and see if I can get some aircraft protection. Bob. What do we have? We also have two cars over. Oh, we have two tier 4 cruisers. They have three tier 6 yeah, cruisers. Oh, this is interesting matchmaking. Let's, let's stick with interesting. Oh, it's lagging quite a bit. A download in the background. Let me switch that off. Yeah, that looks better. And the autopilot having no idea how to drive autopilot a ship. Mode disabled. Loading AP. Yes, let's wish them good luck. What are the cruisers doing? What do we have? A Karlsruhe, Königsberg, and the Cleveland. Cleveland should have good anti air capabilities. I can almost shoot their capturing point from this distance. And I didn't even launch my plane yet. But those sniper shots really, really hard to pull off. Especially when you don't have any targets available. I will do the very, very risky thing and will go through the passage on that side. We'll see how that turns out. Spectacular, I'm sure. I just hope I'm alive when I get out there. Especially that area is bound to be torpedoed. We have their Clemson, okay. Even with scout plane, I will probably bounce off the mountain. All the cruisers seem to go that way so I will stick with that I guess so no risky thing just something similarly risky going that way I could go a little bit slower and let the lead take over by the cruisers but they are fast enough to overtake me anyway this one is right behind that island doesn't look that far behind. The Cleveland's still with me. Cleveland is right there. And the Congo is going into the strait. So, change my mind once more. Do I bounce into anyone? No, I don't. Cleveland and a Königsberg as well. And who's going the other way? The cars is. We have torpedo bombers. No, that uh, those are normal bombers. Oh, and there's one of the Mutsukis. Now I'm again torn between the ammunition types because for the destroyer, I would love to use normal 
HE shells for the bigger ships. I'd like to use my armor piercing. On the other hand, we have enough cruisers here. So we should be able to ignore the destroyer for a moment. His torpedoes are already in the water. You can see them from here, so we wait a tiny bit. Turning down the speed. What do we have there? There is the Congo. Let's fire one gun just to see if it hits. Yes, it does. So, here comes the rest for you. Take it. Torpedoes to port. Oh, not a single... Citadel hit. And those torpedoes look rather dangerous. But I can evade them. My guns already reload? Wow, that was fast, but where is where is it? Scout plane, go! Where is it? There it is. Three hits again. Of 12 shells, but he's pretty damaged. Nuremberg, even if I punt my full broadside with my vulnerable citadel at him, I should be able to stand his fire a little bit, at least enough to bring down the Congo. AP on the Nuremberg will probably over-penetrate like hell. We'll see about that. He will try to run. Ooh, come on, camera, don't do that to me now. It is incoming again. We will turn into them. And one thing I learned, if you take a torpedo in the uh, middle part of a battleship and you angle the hull, you will have a lot less water breaking in. So no water break in, even though I took quite a bit of damage here. So far we lost four ships, they lost three ships. My scout plane is gone. There is a phoenix. Can I shoot that from here? It's pretty slow, is it? Okay, firing all my guns, even if a little bit late. Turning the ship, going to full speed. And I sit at that hit him. Nice. I can see for how much damage, but that's always a good thing to happen. And what do we have here? A Yubari. That is bad. Yubari is bad news. We immediately turn just so that I can evade his torpedoes. Or go aground if I go like that, but No chance to avoid that now. Come on, hit him, main guns. You can do it. Oh. oh no, torpedoes. I didn't see those, and that is really, really bad news now. Try to run aground before the torpedoes hit me. Turning the rudder back. Turning the rudder in again. I evaded one of them. That was probably one of the torpedoes from the Ubari. Will we run aground? We might. Not yet. Yes, we do. 
And there we go, we evaded the first salvo. We will just try to get out here without crashing into too much island or port. That was very lucky. A bit stupid, but lucky. As I always said back when in the days when I was playing Counter-Strike, if you can do it with skill, do it with luck. And I did very good. And now, turning all the way around, going back to my cruisers over there. It's no use driving through that narrow passage here now. Every ship is gone on the other side. If they start capturing, I want to be somewhere nearby. Besides, Cleveland is there, Karlsruhe is there. I still wonder why, why there were only three torpedoes in total. Their squadrons were fully loaded. And shouldn't have been a reason to be only one torpedo. Maybe he hit the island, that might have well be the case. Or he dropped them so close that two already hit the island. And he, did he just bomb our cruiser? He did just bomb our cruiser. Okay. Phoenix nearly damaged. How many, how many hits did I do? 24 so far. Two citadel hits, one ship sunk. Well, not the worst match. I can use my repair kit again. This one I will not hit on that distance, but I will try. Since his engines are damaged. And another destroyer. And he will now probably sink the cars over with a very mean broadside of torpedoes. I nearly hit him. And there he goes. He drives right into it. Ouch. That will hurt. Bye-bye, uh, Karlsruhe. Bomb. Damn it! And now, guess who has to face the destroyers? Okay, at full speed, there's no need for me to shoot at that at that kind of range. 15.5 kilometers, 15.6. It's going away from me, so maybe there. There's a Nuremberg. That's something I can shoot at at least. Maybe I'm lucky and he drives right into it. They will come for me, this much is for sure. And since... Ooh, hit. Since uh, the Nuremberg is not very well armored, I will go with AP shells. Sadly, that also means I will shoot all... I will fire all my guns at once. Hmm. Why didn't it fire all my guns at once? Why am I not dead yet? Interesting. I have to stop steering. I will give him my backside. So come on, reload. I can't evade now. Ah, oh, come on. Is that fair? Spoiler, it's not. So, last repair kit. Can't use it since I don't have any. What is it? Heavy? Uh, light damages. There will be a new repair kit on the cruisers on tier 9 and 10. It, well, it will be still be the same repair kit but with a different functionality. This one here repairs light damage. The one on the cruisers will repair critical damage. What do we have left? We have a destroyer, 
me and the aircraft carrier. That's bad. And that stupid destroyer slipped through my viewing range and ran away. I want to win this. They have three to six ships left and I can't shoot a single one. I hope he gets the aircraft carrier. And somewhere here is a destroyer and I cannot, for the love of God, see it. Maybe I can snipe the fucking Nürnberg. I have 15 seconds left on my scout plane, which means yeah, I should try to shoot him. Now or not at all. Let's see. And they went over the island, so that's good. They're on the fly. I didn't aim well enough to the left. That's not good. And somewhere here the last destroyer is still around. I hate that I'm not able to see them. When he shows up, it will be panic on board. He shot his torpedoes from somewhere there. And I just reduced all my camo by firing at the Nürnberg. And we don't lead by point. Damn it, if they destroy the Minikaze, then... How did he repair? Wasn't he on 11 health points? That's probably a different one. My guns are totally pointing the wrong way, and now he probably fires his torpedoes. But I will, I will just slow down and hit. Thank you, Mr. Luck. Now get out of the way, those fucking torpedoes. There we go. And now, leading by points. He's still hunting the aircraft carrier. Let's see, can I help him somehow? I will have to turn my rear guns around all the way, but maybe I'm able to put some shots into the... Come on, all of them! don't want to aim or re-aim or something, I just want all of them to fire. Well, why do I only see four shells? Where's my third gun? Come on, third gun. There we go. And the 11 health point destroyer is dead. Come on. Maybe that shot. Uh, no. Close, but that's not it. If I get... Oh no, they sunk him. And we still lead my points. So I will just be boring and run away. And there, Nürnberg has minus one kill. Oh, he might have accidentally killed that destroyer. Two minutes. A lot of stuff can happen. I don't want to be sunk. I'm detected by aircraft, okay? I don't even see aircrafts anywhere. Hello. Salvo in before I hit the island. Oh, uh, do I want to try? No, I don't want to try. I said I'm boring, so I will be boring. We can start turning our guns around. That would be a good idea. 
Yeah, fire at me all you want. Don't really think you will get me down within one minute. Reloading guns. Come on, get him. Ooh, torpedoes are a danger here. So we'll try to go in that direction. Now we go quickly to the other side because he's trying to attack me from the right. Another way to maneuver? Yes, there is. One down, get them. <laughs> oh. You're facing a tier 6 battleship. We don't go down easy. Now what we'll do is we'll do a full stop. Come on, get him down. Yeah, here comes that one torpedo. And there we go. Come on. Give me the winning thing. Victory! 3000 XP. What did we do? We won three games. Well, for a battleship, 1333 experience points. For a battleship, that was really good. That was a nice game. Thank you for watching. I hope it thrilled you nearly as much as it did me. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.